What's up, brother? Looking strong. Keep it up. You're killing it. On the road to recovery, some refuse to be just passengers. Ready for round two? Yes, sir. No stopping you. And that's what drives Don Picarni every time he comes to the Stephen A. Orthwine hey, Center. Coach is here now. Let me try again. No slacking. That's all I'm saying. The Orthwine Center is the modern and massive health and wellness gym from Paraquad the Disability Services and Support Organization. Paraquad's mission is to champion equity and independence for people with disabilities through services, partnerships, education, and advocacy. Oh, there we go. He's back. And if this gym had a popularity contest... Oh, buddy, don't worry about it. We don't we don't stress the little stuff. Don would be the undisputed champ. We have talked about making Don the mayor of this building. Picarni is a 61-year-old former Division I soccer player and youth counselor who suffered a stroke four years ago. He remembers waking up from a coma to hear people talking about him. Those are my daughters. I hear, oh, sorry girls, your dad will probably never walk again and we're gonna start looking to assisted living. March it up. But instead of surrendering to the storm, Don weathered it with unwavering resolve. Okay, coach, if I would give up on my situation, I wouldn't be letting me down. I'd be letting all these people that believe in me. There we go. Gotta march it up. Despite the lingering struggle with the loss of mobility on his left side. Ready, coach. I'm walking. Don's been determined to reclaim every ounce of independence he lost. Nice job, Aaron. Thank you. Very good. And that determination isn't just for himself. Right on, Keith. He seems to be a beacon of hope. No stopping you, buddy. For everyone around him. Good job. He is an absolute cheerleader. Give me some, brother. No stopping him. No matter what someone's doing, he'll just walk by them in the gym and to continue to uplift them and keep them going. When I see somebody come in, the deer in the headlights, I call it. I said, okay, there's my guy or my girl. I got to help them because they need some help. That attitude may be why his friends and family launched the Walk for Don group on Facebook. Hi, Don. Love you. It's a digital diary capturing his inspiring journey and the zest he brings to everyday life. Baby, good love, good love. If the name Picarni sounds familiar, that may be because Maddie, one of Don's three daughters, has made a name for herself as a professional soccer player. And now, thanks to Don's determination, he can cheer her on from the sidelines once again. There's nothing better than seeing my kids play in college and now Maddie playing in Denmark and Louisville. It's like a thrill. Guided by resilience. Sure, absolutely, coach. He doesn't just navigate his own journey, but lights the way for others. You're staying in the game. No stopping you. It's reinforcing the positivity and giving you the motivation to keep going when you get frustrated. Way to keep working. Don Picarni. Killing it today. The mayor of motivation. You're killing it, man. You're pushing up some weights there, Mike. Firmly believing that quitting is never an option. Right on. I was going to say, you're not tapping out yet on me, are you? For himself. Coach is on fire today. <laughs> Holy cow. Or anyone else. Good seeing you. Have a good weekend.